A Dance of Duality, the struggle between virtue and vice in the early 16th century, renowned artist Lorenzo Lotto painted a captivating piece titled Allegory of Virtue and Vice. This artwork, housed in the West Building on the ground floor in Gallery 39, is a visual narrative that encapsulates the eternal struggle between good and evil. The painting is set against a dramatic backdrop of a stormy sea and cloud-filled sky. It features two central figures a satyr, representing vice, and a child embodying virtue. The satyr with his man's body and goat's legs reclines with an exaggerated smile, peering into a golden urn. His world is darkened by the impending storm symbolizing chaos and moral decay. On the opposite side, the pale-skinned child crouches over objects on dirt ground littered with rocks. Beyond him lies an inviting field of lemon-lime green sweeping up into clouds, an embodiment of purity and hope. A broken tree trunk stands between them, its abrupt end signifies interrupted growth or moral compromise. Yet from this brokenness sprouts new life with emerald green leaves, perhaps suggesting that virtue can emerge even amidst vice. Objects scattered around tell their own tales, shields decorated with human faces and rearing lions signify courage while musical instruments represent harmony. These elements are juxtaposed against red liquid pouring from an overturned and near the satyr, indicative of spilled wine or lost innocence. Lotto's masterpiece serves as both aesthetic pleasure and moral compass for its audience. Each element intricately woven to narrate stories of human nature's duality where virtue is constantly at odds with vice under heaven's watchful gaze.